Hello everyone, welcome, welcome, welcome to you. If this is your first time stumbling across my channel, my name is Grace from Diamond Paint with Grace. Hello. And if you're coming back, welcome back. Uh, if you are here for the first time, I would love for you to be a part of my diamond painting world. And how do you do that? And that's by hitting the subscribe button. And you'll find that in, let me turn around, it'll be in that corner, that one down there. <laughs> Pretty sure it's down there, or is it down there? Let me turn around and let it, 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 it. that one. I've got all confuzzled because I am looking at this camera in all sorts of different directions. It doesn't matter. It's down there. Let's just go with that. <laughs> Next to that is a notification bell, which will go ding each and every single time I upload a new video. What do I have for you today? I have something very interesting. Did. The thumbnail, capture your interest. I know, right? I know. It's in this here, okay? It's in there. It's been kindly given to me by DIY Digital Art. Okay, they asked me to come back and review some of their products for them, but I have some different things to show you today. So without mucking around anymore, let me flip the camera around, okay? Let me pop you onto the table, which is down here in front of me. Okay, and let's open up this package. Come with me, guys. Come, 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 come. Hello, 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 hello. We are here and I've got this package. Now, I am going to take things out one at a time just to build that suspense, okay? So, uh, Ryan, as I said, from DIY Digital Art has been kind enough to send these through. I've got my beautiful knife here with my name. Thank you, Sandra. One of these days, I'll do this in one fluent motion. And you're probably cringing. Okay, there we go, pop that aside. All right, let's pop this over here and let's just put our hand in. And now, in here, there are diamond painting things uh, that are listed in DIY Digital Arts uh, title under others or the others i'm pretty sure so let me just oh, it's going to be like a lucky dip okay let me just see what this is okay we all know what that is let's have a look these are all new different little things to me so we have okay we have a diamond painting tray okay uh, let me zoom you in, I think. I think that might be a bit better. Okay, we've got a diamond painting tray, plate of wax and a pen. Pretty basic kit. We've got some diamonds, special diamonds here. And here, now, I will have to find what this, oh, 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 it's sticky. What is this one? I should have looked. Bear with me one second, guys. I found out what it is. Okay, I thought so. Now, let me pop that on there. This is an anti-slip mad, uh, mad. Oh my gosh, Gracie, use your words, use your words. Pad, it's an anti-slip pad. So, on the back, if you peel that back, okay, this here, it's smooth, it's not sticky. This will grip, okay, it will grip onto something when it's fully down or supposedly, okay? So it will have some sort of grip on it, okay? Now, I'll pop that there just to protect it from dust, assuming, I am assuming that in order for it to grip, the surface should be quite clean, okay? So, this here is, you peel that back, now all of it, uh, this here is sticky. This is what we're going to diamond paint, okay? The sticky on it's pretty cool. And this, once it's diamond painted, for example, if you had your phone on the dashboard, you could put your phone there, like when you're driving, and it should grip. I'm assuming that that's what it is all about. So it's a cutesy little one. Now, I chose this one, and there are other patterns there. Let's have a quick, quick look at the special diamonds. Uh, if you've been watching my channel, I did make some hints at some special uh, special shapes or diamond pattern things were coming my way and here they are. So, okay, 
See, this is this is how not used to things that I am. All the letters and whatever are on here. So they will correlate, I am assuming, yes, to the bags. See that? So this is what we get. We get some, oh, uh, I wish I had better light, but they are so sparkly, these silver ones. And then we've got some uh, pink or magenta crystals. We've got some really big steroidal white ABs. <laughs> Some teeny tiny white pearlescent ABs. These are cute. So I call them pearly because there's no facets on them. They're completely rounded. And then we've got some marquee diamonds here. And which ones are these? And these are teardrop ones. So that's gonna look really super pretty. Very, very pretty. Now, Think about these guys in any number of ways. I cannot remember the prices of them. They're really, they're not expensive at all. However, the reason that I'm kinda, not kinda, I really am, uh, I'm talking about them today, is that you can start thinking about stocking stuffers. You can start thinking about teacher's gifts. You can start thinking about all sorts of things. All right, all packed away, let's put that aside. Let's go for another lucky dip in here. Oh, 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 this, this feels long. <laughs> all right, let's do this one. All righty, it's a box. Oh, oh, and that's just giving it away. I love coffee. So I know a few creators have done these. And I thought, you know what, I've got to get on the bandwagon and show this along with everything else that's in this category. So this is a coaster. And you all know how much I love my coffee. You all know it. How many times does my coffee machine go off <laughs> um, during my, my um, what do you call it? My, oh my gosh, Gracie, use your words. And why isn't this focusing now? There you go, thank you, um, during my videos. So this here, again, I think, hang on, let me see, should peel back. Let me get me some tweezers over here. Does it peel back? Is it gonna peel back? Oh, that's peeling back too much. This is super stuck down. Interesting. Why isn't this lifting? What am I doing wrong? What am I doing wrong? Well, there's cork at the bottom and it's actually ceramic. So I'm glad that it came in this hard box because coming all the way from overseas, it would have gotten knocked about. Okay, so use some tweezers, guys, and just lift. There you go. It's just all about having a bit of finesse. Watch me drop this now and smash it, right? Oh, if I put it down, you see all the good things. I did have it, I promise you. Oh my goodness. Wow, this is just struggle straight. I had it for a split second. Okay, and there. Oh my, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Gracie. There. Ah. And it keeps falling off. Ah. Okay. Wow. Wow. And I almost lifted off the actual print, but I'm not going to touch it too much. But yes, it is sticky. Okay. All that just to show you that. My goodness. I love coffee. So I... I think, you know, eventually I may collect the set of these, but I'm, I might actually get, for example, a set of six of these or eight and whatever. I don't know, <coughs> pardon me, how they will go with the diamonds on them. You do get a toolkit. So with everything that comes to you, you always will get a toolkit. Oh, these are in bobbly bobblies. So these, oh, okay. How do I tell, hang on. Oh, I see, I see, I see. Okay, so that's your code here. C 
see the A? So that A will be, where's the A on here? Is that an A? Oh, the A is the light brown here, this, the inner border, okay? So that's, it's a, it's a copper color. This is a triangle and the triangle will be, oh, in the middle of the cup here and in here. Oh, nearly drops it. It's gonna be a process of elimination. So the U, these ones here, will be all in here. Okay, and then that just leaves these ones here, which is the black, which will be the border, and the eye, steam, the outline of the cup, and then the word coffee. So cuties, yeah? Think about party favours uh, at kids' parties or uh, party favours for your bonbons at Christmas. Yeah, like, you know, you know, if you're having Christmas together and, and you're wanting some party ideas or stocking stuffers, whatever. Think along those lines. That's why I'm bringing all these little gifts to your attention. Shall we keep going? Yes, let's go into the bag. And what are we going? I, I want to leave that big thing to last, whatever that is. I cannot remember. All right. Another something black, only this is black and big. <laughs> so, what is this fun? Let's have a look. And you'll notice the theme, guys, that they are all special diamonds or special shapes. So we've got our boat, pen, you know it. We've got our diamonds here. Oh, and these are all crystals. All crystals. So... Do you want me to open this or this first? Tell me, because of course, like as if I can hear you anyway, right? But they're all crystals once again, and we've got, ooh, pearlescent, pearlescent uh, focus, yellow this time, and little crystals and big crystals. They're all just crystal, 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 crystal. Ooh, these are tiny. Or maybe they just look so much why isn't this focusing? Oh my goodness. These are just tiny because I'm looking at them compared to these ones here. Maybe that's just the normal size of a diamond. <laughs> but let's have a look at what Gracie has here. You're probably thinking, oh, we've seen this before, Grace. It's a bag. We know. We know. But you're wrong. If I tell you you are wrong, let me zoom you out. It's looking like a bag. It may feel like a bag. But what's this? It may still be a bag. But what's going on? What is this? I know, right? It's an apron. It is an apron. Or some parts of the world, they call it a pinafore. I think I might have to extend these for me. <laughs> That's for sure. However, shall we turn around and see, because oh, I cannot remember what pattern I got, but let's have a look. Voila. Oh, I got the butterfly one. Look at that. So, yep, yep, sticky. Oh, that is super sticky. How absolutely gorgeous is that going to look? How's that? And it's got two little pockets, okay. How cutesy is this? I reckon it's probably a, either a very petite person, male or female, or a kitty size, because let me tell you, this, in, this, this ain't gonna wrap, wrap around this mama here. <laughs> but looking at all these colors, how absolutely stunningly bright and bling bling is this apron gonna be? Oh my gosh. Now. You're probably thinking, Gracie, once it's dirty, how are you going to clean it? You know what? I have no clue. None. None whatsoever. I'm going to leave that to you guys to work out because I haven't got a clue. I am assuming, you know, maybe wear it where you're not going to get so dirty. It could be just more a novelty thing at the end of the day. So you do have all of these and I hear a clonk, clonk, clonk to go on. 
and it's going to be an amazing, amazing end result. Look at that. How cute. Alrighty, so this one comes with how many? Oh, they're not counted out. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, nine, ten, eleven. Eleven different ones. These are probably ones that you could really smash out um, again very, very quickly. Again, you may have a kids' party, you know, more uh, older kids, and you can have these as party favours, and they could be sitting around doing activities. Think outside the square, guys. You may, again, have, uh, if you don't have children, you could have um, things that you have been asked to donate, for example, to a school fair or something like that. There's all sorts of things that you can actually be as a diamond painter that you are, and it's not gonna fold up the right way again, but as the diamond painting person that you are, you can give something that's completely different and outside the square to everyone else. See what I mean? Like we've got a, we often kind of may think, I hear a lot of comments about people being hesitant to give a diamond painting to someone uh, because they're concerned about uh, how it's received and if it's appreciated and so on and so forth. But I think all these little bits and pieces together are pretty cool. All right, what else have I got? What's this one? Oh, I think I remember this. And you're kind of going, what is that one now, Gracie? What have you done? Okay, a lot of crinkling here. Come on, open up. Oh. Now, this <laughs> I have no use for, but I wanted to show you because it's there. Again, your toolkit, yeet. Again, we've got our diamonds and looking at the amount here, it's going to work up really, really quickly. It's, you know, all these are what we would call partials. So this is kind of like a rose gold. That's an aquamarine, red, orange, black and silver. And they're all crystals, okay? You ready? <laughs> I just had to. <coughs> I just had to. Do you know what it is yet? Have you seen these? Have you got a clue? <laughs> Let me zoom you out. <laughs> the things I do. The things I do. Are you ready? Oh no, I haven't done any of my counting. Anyway, we'll do it now. Oh no, do it. A three. Voila. <laughs> it is a little pet coat. So either a little doggy <laughs> or a little cat. Well, that would be a big cat, I would think. Or, a, you know, it's an animal coat. You know, like, see? Can you see how it works? Like the, the two front legs would go that way. And Okay, so hang on. Let's, let's go. Oh, gosh. I'm not doing a very good thing here. All right, imagine these three fingers was the animal's head, whether it be a cat or a dog, and this is the front leg, and this is the front leg, and then the two other legs would be down here. So it's a little animal coat. <laughs> Even our furry friends can get diamond painted. So <laughs> this particular one has a butterfly on a kitty cat. <laughs> so if this is your thing, go for it. <laughs> oh. Uh, it is definitely sticky. Again, once it's this gets dirty, I'm handing it back to you guys to work out how to clean it. But it was just something definitely super cute. You might want to have a couple of these and maybe if you're super duper interested in them and you've got your furry friends, you could uh, have, you know, if you're having a dinner party or entertaining friends or if you've got people coming over, you can dress up your little fur baby in one of these for the night at least and keep it for best <laughs> oh that is so cute i've got to admit i don't have a cat but that is cute come on it's something different it is something different i, I don't know that i would put a human 
I, I wouldn't put a tiny human in here, no. <laughs> but definitely a fur baby. <laughs> oh, come on. You gotta, you gotta look at that. <laughs> Imagine your fur baby being all blinged out in that. Oh, lovely, oh, lovely. All right. Oh, how many other things have we got in here? I don't know. I think there's only one more. Okay, there is only one more, and it's this box here. Yep, that's it. Yeet. All right, so this is going to be interesting. Wow. Oh, this one, this one is business right now. Okay. All right. Let's um, let's have a look at what's going on in here first. Let's have a look-see. Oh, what's going on in here? Because this is something. Oh, okay. The teeniest, tiniest plate of wax I have ever seen. Uh, which is interesting. Okay. They're all crystals. Labelled with letters. So, oh, L. So these are the same size, only this is bigger and this is, uh, sorry, same size. These are the same color. They're a yellow, but these are bigger and these are smaller. And then this one's labeled Q, and that's kind of like that caramel bronze crystal. And then this one here is the same, but it's a larger bronze crystal color. What is going on here? What are these? And these are little silver ones. And these are black, just uh, normal 310s, I'm, I'm gonna say. They're just normal 310s with the worst light out possible. Okay, and how interesting that you get this. It's, there's no grooves in it whatsoever. All right, okay. Well, it makes sense because, like, seriously, how are you going to put these in a normal diamond painting tray, right? All right. But you do get your pen. So, let's have a look at what this is. I know. Look, look, look. Look, look, look. Okay, it's, so it's covered in, oh, okay, okay. So I wonder if this is double-sided adhesive. I was just gonna rip this off, but no, don't do that because I'm assuming that, yes it is, okay. It may, I don't think it is double-sided adhesive, but it is. That is all, okay, now I understand why there's the different sizes, but it is a drinking flask. Oh, it's a drinking flask. Look at this. How super cute. It's plastic. Okay, now you could put uh, water. You could put, a, you know, cordial or flavored, you know, juice. Well, you may have your own diamond painted adult beverage drinking flask, whatever takes your fancy. I don't think anyone would question if you had an adult beverage in this, okay, <laughs> that had a teddy bear and was blinged out. And given all of these blingingness, imagine the sparkle on that. That is awesome. Oh my goodness, I've not seen anyone uh, unbox these and apologies if you have and you're a creator out there and you've already done these and I've just missed your video. I'm trying to, I don't know, that it may be double-sided adhesive, I can't tell. So just be very mindful of it, but there's a teddy bear on that side, there's one on this side. They look to be, okay, so they're the opposite colors. So this is a dark bear with a light background Okay, is that light? So that's a dark bear with a light, and, and that's the drill field. I mean, like, let's, let's be, you know, you've got your drill field there, which corresponds to all the letters on here. 
okay? All those letters that we saw. So there's a dark bear with a light background there. And then there's a light bear with a dark background there. How super cool. <laughs> Gotta trust Mama Grace to find all these things. <laughs> Oh, and it's even kind enough to give you how many meals it is. 350 meals. What's that? Uh, just short of a can of Coke? There you go. Coke and bourbon. No, 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 no. I don't, I don't do bourbon. I don't even know if that's a combination. But you know where I'm going with that. So there you go. Your own personal drinking flask. I love it. I love it. Oh, my gosh. That is awesome. A6 bottle. I don't know where they get that from. Oh, three, hang on. Yeah, 350 mil, 350 mil. It came in this box. Now the box came a bit, you know, mangled. Lucky that it survived though at all because there was nothing protecting, I mean, this is just normal cardboard. So there was nothing protecting this from this to, you know, goodness knows how much weight might've been on top of it as it was being shipped. So I was very lucky that it's come undamaged undamaged how awesome though and it stands up imagine taking that to work and having people look at you going you know ah what's in your flask today <laughs> diy easy cup and asian writing i uh, forgive me i do not understand it you've even got some basic tips here um both in asian at the bottom and in english at the top and a picture on the side. There's your thumbnail. <laughs> and a picture on the side. So how awesome is that, guys? I love it. I love it. I've never seen... Well, I don't do too many special shapes. So I guess I'm not going to see too many variations. But um, I'm certainly looking forward to sitting here and smashing out some of these products and showing you the final result so gosh they're all starting to build up now aren't they between this and my bear but that is that is today's presentation guys how awesome is that i'm trying not to mix everything up because goodness so we've got our flask we've got our fur baby coat we've got our apron We've got our coaster and we've got our non-slip mat. How's that? How's that? I think out of all of them, I think out of all of them, this and this are my favorite. Go figure that they're both beverage related, right? <laughs> uh, however, it is food for thought, uh, so to speak. It is, you know, some different things that you may not even have known had existed. I know I've seen this one or variations of this one done before. Uh, me personally, I've not seen one, two, three, or four done before. So I thought I'd bring them to your attention. And if um, if there's something that you see that you like, I'm not an affiliate with DIY Digital Art. I just uh, love presenting what they've got. And obviously they are a budget site. So keep an eye out guys for uh, licensed work. And, and if that's something that's of interest to you, you should find this under the others tab or under special shapes. You'll find all these things under there. So with that being said, oh my goodness, chin chin and heads up and bottoms up to you. <laughs> Thank you so, so much for watching. A gold medal if you have, okay? And wherever you are in your part of the world, I hope that you have an amazing rest of your day, a fantastic rest of your week, okay? Please look after each other, look after yourselves. All right, and until next time, I am going to be sending you all much, much love and ciao, ciao for now.